Hey there tennis enthusiasts! Welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to explore the fascinating history and evolution of tennis rackets. So let's jump right in. Though tennis officially dates back to 1870, 3. When Major Walter Clopton Wingfield of North Wales published the first book of rules, the sport has roots in earlier handball games that evolved in Europe before the Renaissance. Players initially used their bare hands, then gloved hands, and eventually wooden bats. Rackets first appeared during the 15th century and were smaller than their modern counterparts, with various stringing patterns. Until 1965, all professional tennis rackets were made of wood. But with the introduction of steel and aluminum rackets, a whole new world of design possibilities opened up, allowing for broader racket heads. This innovation, pioneered by Howard Head in the mid-1970s, doubled the size of the sweet spot, making it easier for players to hit the ball. In 1981, the International Tennis Federation, ETF, adopted rules defining acceptable tennis rackets. This came after the controversial spaghetti string rackets were banned from professional play in 1977. The first racket rules allowed any materials to be used and didn't limit size, weight, or shape. However, they did set specific requirements for string spacing and prohibited attachments that could alter the flight of the ball. Over time, the ITF made further adjustments to racket regulations. By 1997, the maximum racket length was set at 29 inches, 74 chem. Today, the average racket measures about 28 inches, 71 chem, and weighs between 10 and 14 ounces, 284, 384, 387 g. There have been many recent innovations in racket technology, though not all have gained widespread popularity. Some companies market hexagonal rackets or extra-wide racket bodies, Others have experimented with materials like graphite fiber reinforced thermoplastic viscoelastic polymer to create variable flexibility depending on the force of the hit. Some designs even aim to alleviate tennis elbow with small lead bearings in the head frame to cushion vibrations. So there you have it. From wooden bats to modern composites, tennis rackets have come a long way. The ongoing advancements in racket technology continue to shape the game we all love. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more amazing tennis content. See you next time.